Okay, y'all better be ready. One intro and one intro only. Okay, hi guys. So I'm here with my girlfriend Stephanie and then her brother Christopher. We did a video on his channel trying a bunch of other foreign snacks like we are doing in my video. So I bought a total of 16 things. It was kind of pricey, so if you are looking to do a video like this, I'm just telling you that it is pricey. We did 8 on his and then we're doing 8 on mine, so let's get started with the video. These, they say the Philippines because from the website World of Snacks where I got these from. Um, they had like Filipino snacks, Korean, uh, English, uh, Germany, Turkish, so I just grabbed a bunch of stuff that I thought looked interesting and I like caramel corn, so I was like, why not? I love caramel corn. Yeah. Um, do they smell good? They don't. They, the, the they smell, smell like burnt pumpkin. It smells like burnt. Um, oh, it actually. Pumpkin. It smells pretty good. It tastes like caramel. They're a little burnty at the beginning, no? They're I'm, good. I no. like them. They are good though. Mm -hmm. I like them. I'm probably gonna eat all those, like in one sit. Probably not. But I give those a ten out of ten because I really did like those. They were nice. Nice right. flavor. Yeah, I give them an 8 out of 10. Pretty good texture. Mm -hmm. Wow, Chris. Drop. Next, wait. Okay. Next, we're going to take a Turkish delight. It's made in. I don't think it's Turkey, even though it says Turkish delight, I'm pretty sure. I think it was England. Yeah, it's, one, it's, a, it's a Cadbury product. Mm -hmm. From England. It okay. says a Turkish delight dip in milk chocolate, so I don't know what Turkish delight it's is. I mean, that it has Turkey. And I didn't want to look it up in case I was afraid. Okay. Um. Oh. Ew. Oh gosh. It kind of looks like. I don't know. It kind of looks like Jello. Yeah. To be honest, it looks like Jello. It looks like cranberry that we get no, at. No, um, don't like it. Don't like it. I taste. <laughs> like I it. taste some like. And then when they start tasting it, it was nasty. No. I know I don't have my napkin thanks to Chris. The chocolate is good. Ooh. Yeah, that's about it. Okay, I didn't like that. No. Zero. Okay. Next. I give it a zero out of ten. Court, what do you feel? How do you feel? I give that oh zero out of ten. Yeah, I give it zero out of ten too. Okay, so Next, we're trying the mango creamy soda. It's white. No, it's kind of orangish, Chris. Not like no, completely look. white. Look. Okay. It's good. It has more flavor in it. And it tastes like. Oh, it smells really good. It smells really good. Yeah, it has a lot. It's really foamy. The other one that we tried on Christopher's channel wasn't this foamy. Mm -hmm. Next, we're going to try the Yorkie. There you go. I like it. I like it. Oh, it's just chocolate. Yeah. I feel like Christian's has, you know, mm -hmm. it's chocolate. Mm -hmm. I like it. I says chunky milk chocolate. This is my favorite so far. Mm -hmm. Me too. Like. Out of all the chocolates we've tried. Yeah, this is my favorite. Really good. Favorite. Favorite. Ten out of ten. Next, we're gonna try the Kit Kat. Uh, ten out of ten. Out of ten. It, it's from. It's Japanese, I think. Yeah, it's J Japanese, and Japan has a bunch of different flavors. And this one is strawberry cheesecake. Okay, and on the back it says, "Have a break, have a Kit Kat," and then it's got something on. So do we want to jump? I don't know. This one. Hold on. Oh, I like color. I don't know, they're like okay. the little mini ones, like for us. Yeah. Alright, let's just give this a go. I don't like cheesecake, so. I'm it not a big fan. It smells. 
It smells like like cheese. Like straight up cheese. It smells like cheese delight. That's actually quite nice. I didn't taste it. Kind of tastes like cheesecake. Yeah, it doesn't really. I mean, it's me. I love cheesecake, and I've eaten like a bunch. I One of my like favorites it. is from Jewel, and it's like New York style cheesecake or something. But I like it. And that I don't think it really tastes a whole lot like cheesecake. Yeah, but it's good. But it's good. good. Yeah. Like I don't cheesecake. know. For me, it kind of has like an aftertaste of coconut. Um, I do like coconut, but I do not like this Kit Kat. Mm -hmm. Next, we're gonna try these like Uncle Joe mint balls. Wait, wait, you're rating on that one? Huh? Rating on that? Oh, for that one, two out of ten. For Kit Kat, I give that a seven out of ten. Nine out of ten. Ten out of ten. Mm -hmm. Next, we're trying these Uncle Joe mint balls. We got them from World Market. You can like smell the peppermint, like it's close, but you can like smell it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's really strong. These are from the UK as well. I'm not a huge fan of peppermint. I love peppermint. I know. Somebody is like in love with mints and like peppermint. I have like a mint body wash and it smells delicious. Look at so this. Really this is how they look. Oh wow. What? I thought it was chocolate. Yeah, I thought it was chocolate too. I thought it was chocolate lint. They look kind of weird. Mine's a black. This is how they look. They're hard. And it says gel. Because they're mint. They're good. At the beginning, it's not strong. I think, I hope it gets stronger. They're really weak. It gets better. It gets okay, more yeah. minty. I like it. For as strong as they smell. Yeah, the taste yeah. really isn't that strong. Well, okay, because like I'm like starting to like lick off like the top coating. It's a lot stronger like when you get into it. Mm -hmm. It's not as strong as I thought it was gonna be though. The scent like gives it off as it's gonna be like. Mm -hmm. It's good. It's gonna like blow you away, but it it's really it, it's a nice ease into it. I would definitely buy these again. Yeah, me too. How do you feel, Court? I wouldn't buy them again. But you I, don't like mint. Yeah, because <laughs> I don't like mint. I but like I will have to say that it is kind of nice, so I'll give it a 6 out of 10. Sometimes it get, sometimes when I taste I mint, but these ones, not that much, it it, burn, it goes into my nose and it burns. Yeah, it's kind of like, like when like mint is too strong, it's kind of like spicy. Like a cough drop. Where am I going to put? I was super. Yes. Choco pie. The choco pie. Where am I going to put this? Oh. In the wrapper. Or not. It says, it's fluffy, choco pie. I was really fluffy, excited. Fluffy, choco pie. This um, is my healthy hamster, he died. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Chris he passed hamster, away. And he passed away, so we keep, well, they keep him in the freezer. Because yeah. right now, if we've had, like, tons of snow in America. Yeah. yeah. And so, and the like, ground, freezing weather. Yeah, yeah, so it's like, everything is frozen. They got to do it when it's more, like, spring. Oh, I don't even know where this choco pie is. Huh? I think it's turkey. I don't know, it doesn't say. But it looks so like if you know where that's from. Let yeah, us know. And it's really big. Yeah, it's ginormous. And it's like really squishy, so I'm super excited. Yeah, because we have moon pies here and they're hard. I believe. Yeah. Yeah, they are. Well, they're not like extremely hard, but they're not like soft. Mm. Where's Joe? Okay. Joe? Oh. oh. We have to get on Okay. It looks really good. Yeah. I'm super excited. Oh, it, I don't know. It's not that hard. It looks it's like a cake. Ours is like a cookie. Mm -hmm. It's not hard. I like it. It tastes like cake too. Mm -hmm. We're eating this violet crumble. Wonder how it tastes. Okay. It's not that hard. It's it tastes like I like it. Uh, it tastes like cheese in the inside. It does not taste like cheese. No. Mm -hmm. Um. Okay, if you've ever seen like drywall, like before they like put it up on your wall or whatever, if you've ever like cracked a piece of your wall open, it kind of like the inside part looks exactly like that. Yeah, I don't really like that soda either. I mean, it was okay. Um, I really, really enjoy it. I have no idea what is in it, 
to the front. For me, it tastes like really, really good. They have this bar, uh, this 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 actual like chocolate bar called Honeycomb, and it wasn't bad, but this is gross. This I, is delicious. I can't stand it. Ugh. And this soda, I don't know what I rated it, but if I rated it good, I want to re-rate it because it was like a two out of ten. Kind of nasty. I'm giving it a seven <clears throat> out of seven. I want like twenty of these for my birthday. It was disgusting. What? All right, so that's all for this week's video. See you guys next week. Bye bye. We and Stephanie are going to be doing the uh, guess that body part challenge that we were supposed to do last yeah, week. Yeah, a really long time ago. Oh, and after that one, we are going to do the try Stephanie's favorite Mexican candy slash foods because I'm Mexican. Me too. Oh no, but yeah. Thanks bye for watching, bye. guys. Bye. See you next time.